Good night, everyone. Today is Monday, uh, January 17, and we're going to go over with a video all day, the technical video all day for tomorrow, Tuesday. Uh, very slow markets in the opening yesterday uh, due to the New York, uh, United States holiday for Martin Luther King Day. Uh, so, but we're expecting the, the markets to start picking up a bit from, he from here on. Uh, but technically nothing has changed I mean around the market nothing has changed we have played a little bit with the counts trying to present to you guys the best uh, view or the best of the, of the uh, scenarios because like we always say we always play with uh, uh, different scenarios and we present the one with the highest possibility to you guys that's the way that we believe it should be. I mean, because Elio Ways have that. Elio Ways always going to give you two or three points of view. And you as a trader needs to find out which one do you think is the more important. I mean, technically, uh, you can know all the... Uh, that's why market interrelationship is very important for everyone. Okay, so let's start with it. Let's start with what we're waiting for, what we're trying to get, the long dollar... Your agents and I have received some emails uh, asking me why we trade like that. Is that that's the way we do it? I mean, I remember first we got in right here, and we we got about 100 picks. We were about 100 picks up last Friday, but we didn't know if there's gonna be a gap. I ain't gonna go higher. Believe me, it, we're gonna get it. Uh, I believe that this is the short to that is taking place. Is it a a triangle B and a CW, A, B, C, S, a zigzag in weight, uh, the Y right here, and a double zigzag, A, B, C, uh, y, uh, W, S, or can be like this, like a flag right here, and then another A, B, C, one, A, and a B, C right here. So technically, I believe that this is this was with uh, wave S, and this is W, this is a three-way move, looks like another three ways move to the outside, and there should be a final push to around 81, 82 level. I want you to understand, guys, that we're going to stay as we are with the entry and 82.20, I believe it is, 82 and 81.56 or 81.60 against this low. This trade looks good. This is correct. Look at the uh, magnitude right here. This is correct, and this should go higher. All right? That's about. That's telling me that the dollar is gonna get strong pretty soon. Now, this is the New Zealand. The New Zealand. We have one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. A, B, C, A, A, B, C, B, and a flat. And from here we got one two one two when this two was a flat and then we got three there is separation here and then we go three four it looks like a triangle four and it's possible that the New Zealand remember last week on Thursday or the weekend day I mentioned that any trade around 7750 against 7816 should be a good trade look probably I mean probably the New Zealand top already there's probably a top in place because if you take that it's, it's gonna test the channel right here the outtrain channel so you gotta be careful about it but it's probably that it's top already so this is another pair that is gonna show probably a dollar strength in the near future okay this is the euro against the pound this is getting interesting here because most of the most of the uh, euro pairs Sh it's, it's showing like it needs one more legs out. Everyone know that the, that the euro, that the euro pound is coming from the, uh, it's a, it's, uh, a triple six uh, from the highs, and we are in weight. If I am not incorrect, in weight C of weight Y. So technically, we got an ABC here looks like a flag ABC here because this is this is like a triangle here one two three four five and look we already have one two three four and a five right here so that's very interesting here we're calling for the price 
to get low but anyway this needs to be corrected because it's the five ways and that's probably gonna go with where, what it left for the final push higher in the US uh, in the euro dollar so it goes with the whole market let's see how it works out okay this is the euro the euro we wrote we're going with, with what it looks to be the flat uh, the euro so far Fibo Y is a beauty. This this place right here, Fibo Y is a beauty. We got uh, it would take the the Fibo time from here. This is a four hour chart, so technically for here to here, it took 16, 16 times four equal sixty four hours. Sixty four hours to develop wave one then let's see how many hours goes in wave four right here Watch. in wave four so far right here that 10 so far we got 14 so the point is that they're getting to the point that's similar in times and um, if we open out right here the euro and we go like this let me put it in candle so you guys see better look it's A, B, C, W oh A, I put an A but it's a W it looks like, no I'm sorry it's A right here that's what I'm putting I remember this is a flat B and then another way down five weeks right here on C so there is a change and this is an impulse there is a change that the correction is over and what it's waiting is to test the channel right here if you look at it it's almost to test the channel before it broke higher now a selling around this level 131 135.08 135.90 136.20 is a 50 percent for, for for the whole declines in november that's that's a good short on the euro in my own opinion i won't do it i won't play with the euro until i see it clear because the movement in the euro that they are strong so i don't want to play for the currency and risk some money there so i, I feel comfortable with the straw to in the in the uh in the u.s dollar uh, gen and then a u.s dollar swedish franc i feel very comfortable about those two pairs more comfortable than the euro pre, uh, dollar right here we should get also in a strong divergence with a new high right here so I don't say don't do it I know I, you guys know I provide we provide the, the charge and you guys take decision you guys doesn't have to do what we do but where this is a good selling here I don't like picking but where it looks like it's a good selling let me see more pairs now let me show you that the, the uh, another one that I want to show you because we change accounts a little bit okay let me show you first the euro against the Swedish franc look same structure to here as you guys see same structure to here looks three looks correct a b five ways down testing the 38.2 should we should get a new high and that should be it with that way four already so that's a euro a euro with this uh, against the Swedish franc let me show you the euro cat because I want to show you the four hours on the euro cat I wish I can have a little shot opens guys we save some minutes sometimes okay first for those who love free levels we were calling this to be the end of the way one but today working the counts we got time because of the slow market we get to the conclusion and look at these guys this is amazing look if we this is always being wave one and a flat way two for us we got one two three triangle four to m5 but look at this if you take the fever level for proposal one two is exactly to the pit the 6.85 which is usually the stand that you can get in way three that's telling me that way five is going to be a show one um not only that let's take that fever out 
let's take the FIBO out right here and we trace the FIBO for proportional wave for as a flat and look at that to the pit also and to the 38.2 so we feel very comfortable about this count right here and this pair we feel very comfortable what we need right here is he almost had five ways down we need three back right here like this and then should trade lower some degree to trade should start turning lower around the 61.8 of the proposal decline here let me show you the the dollar against the uh, the Swedish franc we show in a nice bullish structure too show you the New Zealand already so you know that, okay this one right here if you guys see the dollar is getting weak as we predict we believe that we got a b c and then we got a triangle weight s and we should get something similar to around 90, 95.42 an extension lower should be around 98 95 98 94 but if we take measures here look it's gonna be equal legs around 95 so 95 is huge right here for this pair but this man this uh, this is better be honest with you guys this is much better than trade the euro much better than pick on the euro or anything like that why because you got a clear five ways out with a clear impulse way look the way three how standard it went divergency triangle a clear five weeks after five ways at least another five ways coming so it's better this to go and buy in levels right here we believe that it's more weakness in the u.s dollar like we've been saying but we believe that it's better buying here buying here and even buying on the 76.6 percent 76.4 percent around this area that start picking on the euro because the euro sometimes look what happened last week i mean the euro is just, i mean it runs man the euro can get you out of the trade in the one two three last i want to show you the silver and gold if we have time i want to show you the silver trade and the gold shark okay silver right here why i want to show you silver because the thing is this this is five ways decrying three ways back but looks unless that's what we switch and we adjust because we always knew that there is that there was a chance that if we don't focus the count that much the silver it will allow you a high a new high in difference with gold gold was showing a 10 minute move in an ending diagonal but silver it was i mean you can play with uh with the count a bit and it will be allow you a new uh a new high so it looks unless it is a one two one two and this level is respect before a new low this is a three-way and then it should get back if we take measures right here you're gonna see guys how these things work with the fuel the low is the 61.8 usually it can be the end of the way c also and last let me see if I found gold pretty fast. I got one more minute to go. No, let's let's better show you the Aussie. This is what we see on the Aussie. We believe that we got one more high right here, probably in way C, because there is no five ways here. Something like do like this, get a new high at around here. I mean, I, I see Dora witness in the next 12 hours. That's what we see, and that's what we believe is going to happen. So that's probably it, and then wait two ends, and the house is going to drop. So, guys, let's hope that everything happens the way that we say, and get back tomorrow. If there is anything important, we're going to do a later update on a later uh, boss update that we do now then. Thank you.